best new thing in the world. Okay, uh, Republicans in Congress put a provision in last month's payroll tax cut extension, which said that the president had to make a decision within two months on the Keystone pipeline. Forced decision, their timeline. Today, President Obama called their bluff by saying he was not given enough time to assess the pipeline's impact. So you want a decision now? Okay, here's your decision. No, no pipeline, at least not right now. And that brings me to our best new thing in the world today. I am very flattered that I have been chosen for the rare and special honor of being the new face of the National Republican Congressional Committee. It's the part of the National Republican Party that tries to elect Republicans to the House. They have reenacted one of the ads I made where I'm standing in front of the Hoover Dam talking about infrastructure. Except in their version, they've got me, uh, or someone who looks just like me, saying that President Obama should say okay to the Keystone XL pipeline. When you were this close to Hoover Dam, it makes you realize how small a human is in relation to this as a human project. You can't be the state who builds this. You can't even be the town who builds this. But you can be the guy that stops something like this. We've got a project like this waiting for the president's go-ahead, supported by Republicans and Democrats, labor unions. It provide energy security and up to 130,000 jobs. National Republican Congressional Committee, you guys nailed me. You got me exactly right. Seriously, it's uncanny. Especially the hair. You totally got my hair exactly right because this is what my hair looks like. Best new thing in the world today. I take it as a profound compliment that you even know who I am, let alone take time to make fun. Many thanks. <laughs> now it's time for the last word with Lawrence O'Donnell. Have a great night.